Hello everyone. So welcome to this lecture. And in this lecture, we'll start with exercise number two. And in exercise number two, total four type of problem is there. So today we'll start with the D of Fenton equation. Since in my last lecture already we have covered exercise one, and we have seen type one, type two, type three, type four. So here, so here we'll start with the D of Fenton equation. And in D of Fenton equation, before solving the problem. We'll see some some introduction part. The equation of the format a x plus b y equal to c is called D of Fenton equation, where a, b, and c is nothing but it is a known constant integer. And in this type of problem, here we have to estimate x and y, and where the a, b, and c will be given. So to calculate x and y, we can use this formula. X equal to x zero. B by D into T, and to calculate Y, we will use the formula Y zero minus A by D into T, and where X zero and Y zero will be calculated from Euclidean algorithm, and this B is nothing but it is a part of the problem only. That is A X plus B Y equal to C. This is A, so and this is A and this is B. So this B is the same as what this B. Now D is nothing but uh, it is a GCD of A comma B. And from the D of Fenton equation, A and B will be already given. So after that, what we'll do now here? Here we'll find the GCD of A and B, and whatever the GCD of A and B will get, that will be considered as a D. So this is a D. So we'll divide B by D, and whatever result come, it will be multiplied by T. T is an integer, and after adding with the x zero, we'll get the value of x. And similar case can be also applied with the y also. So this is all about the theoretical part of D F and an equation, and from the coming lecture, we'll start with the solution part. Thank you.